English Story Times, Book 36, Story 9. Watching a Jeweler at Work. Line 1. He's a jeweler. He's a jeweler. What's his occupation? What's his occupation? He's a jeweler. Line 2. Security is an important. Security is an important requirement for him. Requirement for him. Because he works with. Because he works with. Gold and precious stones. Gold and precious stones. Security is an important requirement for him because he works with gold and precious stones. Question. The most important requirement, the most important requirement in his business is what? In his business is what? And why? Why? Well, security is an important requirement for him because he works with gold and precious stones. Line three, good eyes and steady hands. Good eyes and steady hands are physically required to do this work, to do this work. Good eyes and steady hands are physically required to do this work. Question, what are, what are physically required? What are physically required? Well, good eyes and steady hands are physically required to do this work. Line four. Some common pieces of jewelry are, some common pieces of jewelry are earrings, necklaces, watches, rings, pins. Earrings, necklaces, watches, rings, pins and bracelets, and bracelets. Question, what are some common pieces of jewelry? What are some, what are some common pieces of jewelry? Common pieces of jewelry. Well, some common pieces of jewelry are earrings, necklaces, watches, rings, pins, and bracelets. Line five. This view is interesting. This view is interesting because it's a realistic view, because it's a realistic view of what a jeweler has when he works. Of what a jeweler has when he works. This view is interesting because it's a realistic view of what a jeweler has when he works. Question. What makes this view, what makes this view of his working kind of interesting, of his working kind of interesting. What makes this view of his working kind of interesting? Well, this view is interesting because it's a realistic view of what a jeweler has when he works. Okay, line six. Sales, carpentry, and prostitution. Sales, carpentry, and prostitution are three professions as old as his profession. Are three professions as old as his profession. Sales, carpentry, and prostitution are three professions as good as his profession, as old as his profession. What are four professions about the same age? What are four professions about the same age? Well, sales, carpentry, and prostitution are three prostitute, three possessions, uh, not possessions, professions, whoa, are three professions as old as his profession. Okay, seven. The modern term downsizing, the modern term of downsizing doesn't relate to his job. Doesn't relate to his job. The modern term of downsizing doesn't relate to his job. Question. What modern business term, what modern business term doesn't apply to jewelers? Doesn't apply to jewelers. 
what modern business term doesn't apply to jewelers? Well, the modern term of downsizing doesn't relate to his job. Line eight. He can count on being employed. He can count on being employed as long as he wants to be employed. As long as he wants to be employed. He can count on being employed as long as he wants to be employed. Question, how long can he, how long can he count on being employed? Count on being employed. How long can he count on being employed? Okay, your goal, 48 seconds. He's a jeweler. Security is an important requirement for him because he works with gold and precious stones. Good eyes and steady hands are physically required to do this work. Some common pieces of jewelry are earrings, necklaces, watches, rings, pins, and bracelets. This view is interesting because it's a realistic view of what a jeweler has when he works. Sales, carpentry, and prostitution are three professions as old as his profession. The modern term of downsizing doesn't relate to his job. He can count on being employed as long as he wants to be employed.